What's going on, people? It's your boy Detroit King Ben coming at you with another video, man. Right here on Lionheart TV, man. Where we only keep it real. You feel me? Yeah, man. We on another video, man. And this is some shit that I just seen, man. It seemed like the police. Why is the police doing so much right now, man? I just don't understand this shit. Let me somebody can leave a comment or something, man, to let me know something, man. Like it seems every day, man, the police is beating somebody the police is killing somebody man you know whether what color they are they just doing a lot right now and i just want to know why man why do we need these motherfuckers if they not fucking helping all they doing is fucking killing and beating the shit out of people man all i need y'all to do me is one favor before we get into this fucking video Hit that subscribe button. Turn on the notification bell so you know every time your boy drop another banger. Big story tonight. A woman in handcuffs punched in the face by a Southern California police officer. Fellow officers step in to pull him back. Our Jory Rand hearing from an eyewitness. He's live in Westminster with more. Jory. Mark, we're not really used to seeing this. Officers stepping in to stop another officer from doing something they think may have crossed the line. And tonight that officer is now under what? investigation. Wow, what? Tonight, a Westminster police officer is on leave after this video surfaced of him punching a woman in handcuffs in the face. And what makes this incident so noteworthy is that two fellow officers stop him, physically block him from landing any more blows. He intervened and stopped him, and they made him go to- Punk ass cops, man. Back out from the scene. We got motherfuckers like that, bro. We paying using our tax money, you can see paying our tax money for these motherfuckers to do shit like this to a woman, man. I would have slapped her ass in the back of the squad car, man. Off with her, man. She a, she a female. Imagine if he do that to her. What he doing to other people? What he get get doing? Or at least with the taxpayers' money, man. Come on now, man. Was accused of assaulting a woman in the street. Her own brother, then basically making the police's case for them. When we opened the door, they're trying to put handcuffs on her, and she was resisting. Huh. They're walking her out, and when we got out of the walkway, that's when she started kicking the shins, and that's when they threw her to the plants. Doorbell video caught officers picking Garcia back up out of the flower bed and walking her towards the street. This isn't her first run in with police. Back to her brother for the history. I guess she assaulted another Asian lady, but they're trying to make her apologize because they know she has mental disorders. And um, that time, I, I guess she assaulted the cops too, but right here in the front. This rare instance of officers restraining one of their own comes just days after a Minnesota jury convicted former officer Derek Chauvin in the murder of George Floyd. Three other officers stood around as Chauvin knelt on the dying man's neck for nine minutes and they did nothing. All three face aiding and abetting second degree murder charges. These officers weren't going to let something similar happen to them. There we go, man. The boys on blue doing their job again, man. Protecting the server, man. Like, you know, when is it gonna come to where enough is enough and somebody step up and say this old this old shit, this old police shit, and this old laws and shit need to go the fuck out, man. If you're not from that neighborhood, you don't need to be patrolling the neighborhood. Okay? If you're not from that area, from the hood, you don't need to be doing shit. Because for one thing, you're scared. You're scared of a fucking 13-year-old. And you got a gun. You got a baton. You got all of this shit. Taser. And you're afraid of a, a, a kid. And some changes need to be made, man. For real, man. Like I said... It's your boy Detroit King, man. If you like the video, like the video, man. Hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell, man. I'm out of here. Peace.